like I should add a disclaimer in this video because I do a lot of dumb things that are really funny, but I don't want anyone watching my videos thinking it's okay to do the same and end up hurting themselves. This is not a safety video, but I just want you to keep in mind I do a lot of things unsafely throughout the video, and this is for entertainment purposes only. Enjoy. The tires, you know, all this stuff that's not a part of the frame, we're going to take off. Thank God. You stupid. I can't hear you over the ringing in my ears. We're gonna do 150, then 320, then 400. And that'll get the whole frame to a nice even consistency so that we don't have any like levels on our paint.
We're doing a fluorescent green, super bright green, and a matte black. We're doing mostly black, and parts of it are going to be the bright green. You are pretty much my only source of light. No, don't hit the camera, don't hit the camera, don't hit the camera. That was a bad idea. Wait, are you going towards me? No, don't go over there. The can's not working, are you kidding me? It's not working. Oh my god. Alright, we're going to get green paint again, hopefully... Hopefully it actually works this time. Don't go over there, don't go over there. This is what the first coat looks like. Not bad, we probably should have put a base coat on first. Like a white or something, but that's not a big deal. No. It's doing it. Hold oh, on, maybe I have to warm it up. I'm never using this paint again. But I found that if you do the high quality Rust Oleum brand, if you take the nozzle off of that, plop it onto this, it won't sit perfectly, but it will spray. It will at least spray. It will make a big mess on your hands and stuff, but I got the third coat done on this go-kart. One, two, three. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm trying to make higher quality videos, so let me know what you thought. If you want to watch a more in-depth video without the humor, check out this other go-kart video. It's a complete restoration of a vintage cart I found rotting away in someone's backyard.